Hi there. Welcome to the Virtual Orientation for the Network Technical Support Program. My name is Drew Holman. I'm the coordinator for both the AMISA program as well as the Network Technical Support Program at Conestoga College. I've been teaching networking and IT infrastructure at the college since 2017. I've also been working in the industry for over 20 years. So I just want to say welcome to the program. Um, it's a one-year Ontario College certificate program, as you can see in the link below. You can see the details on the program. Business is ever evolving to include more and more information technology resources for staff, which allows increase for productivity in the workplace. This two-semester Ontario College certificate program enables you to gain critical knowledge and skills required to configure and troubleshoot end-user computers, servers, operating systems, infrastructure services, and networks. Students will refine their skills by completing activities that are typical in the business setting within an IT support role, focusing on clients' needs. Semester one, we start with career launch. This program prepares students to conduct an effective job search. Students will explore labor market trends to uncover hidden job markets. Students will learn to identify their transferable skills and market them effectively. They will also create target resumes and cover letters aimed at employers in their field Students will learn strategies to communicate their skills effectively in an interview. The fundamentals of ITIL. ITIL is a standard used in all aspects of information technology, and as such, students will explore the fundamentals of how ITIL relates to the IT industry. The students will consider best practices within the areas of communications, project planning, and customer service. Hardware fundamentals. A practical hands-on ability to work with hardware in an IT setting is essential for any IT professional. Students will be able to identify internal components of a desktop computer as well as choose the cost of new systems based on user requirements. Network fundamentals. Identifying and troubleshooting basic network issues is an essential skill required by anyone working in an IT department. Students will cover many topics, including internet networking fundamentals, Ethernet LANs and switches, IP addressing, subnetting, and network security. Integrated Project One. In addition to working on specific tasks, IT professionals are often called upon to plan and complete large projects. Students will work as a member of a team to complete a large project demonstrating skills and knowledge gained from the previous courses in semester one. Software Fundamentals. Software issues are commonplace in any IT environment. Students will install, configure, and secure operating systems, uh, operating system software on Windows-based client machines. Windows Server 1. Very few businesses operate without Windows Server being deployed in an organization. As a result, anyone working in the IT today needs the ability to manage Windows Server. Students will gain the skills and knowledge required to administer and secure Windows Server infrastructure. Semester two. Windows Server two will build upon skills learned in Windows Server installation and configuration, as well as implement Microsoft Azure. In this course, students will learn to manage Active Directory users, groups, and configure group policy. SQL Server. Microsoft SQL Server is one of the most popular database management systems used by businesses today. As a result, anyone working in the IT needs will be able to manage Microsoft SQL Server. This course will focus on installing Microsoft SQL Server as well as supporting clients to the use of a variety of SQL commands. Email configuration and operations. Many businesses use Exchange Online as their email host. Students will learn the skills and knowledge required to manage an Office 365 mail platform. This course will primarily focus on installing Exchange Server, Exchange Online, as well as configuring and troubleshooting core services, including basic storage configurations, message flow, and online client configuration. Linux Server. Linux and the knowledge, Linux skills and the knowledge are in high demand in businesses infrastructure today. As a result, the operating system is used where high resource usage and security is needed. Students will install, configure, and secure operating systems on multiple clients. Virtualization. Virtualization is the heart of business infrastructure or cloud computing today. Participants will gain the hands-on knowledge by installing, configuring virtual systems. 
skills covered will include configuring and administering network and storage resources, deploying and managing virtual machines, as well as monitoring and managing resource consumption. Integrated project two. Students will demonstrate as a team member the skills and knowledge gained throughout this program to complete large scale projects, responding to requirements, documents, teams, will, teams will plan, build, and present systems that will, that will require research in the technology that have not been previously implemented in class. So what will we be doing in the program? First of all, we'll be building computers, we'll be working with our hands and building uh, physical systems. We also will be working with physical network hardware. There are routers and switches available for students to use. They will wire and configure these systems. Installing Windows Server. Over the course of the program, the students will install multiple versions of Windows Server, configure, troubleshoot, and work through the programs. And so much more. Things like installing a VMware, working with SQL, Linux Server, as well as racking hardware. This program runs at the Kitchener campus of, college, of Conestoga College. If you go to the Conestoga website and select visit on the top left corner, you can take a virtual tour of the campus. But here are some great features. There are open computer labs. The Dune campus has several open access labs that are available for students to use. This lab space provides students with the use of hardware and software that support their learning and give them opportunity to keep their study, study notes and projects on track. There are also Bring Your Own Device Labs. Bring Your Own Device Labs are well, is a well-designed space that will, is equipped with raised workstations, which allow students to have the option to sit or stand while working. In this lab, students will bring their own hardware into the lab and connect directly to Conestoga servers and networks. Learning Commons. So Learning Commons are the three services designed for you to organize, improve your study skills, provide access to tutors, and build confidence in the subjects like math and writing. The venue. The venue is an on-campus bar, restaurant, and entertainment space. Conestoga Students Incorporated provides this campus space for students and staff and faculty. It offers a great menu where you can enjoy breakfast, lunch, and or dinner. This program is bring your own device. And what that means is students must have their own laptop or computer that meets the specific needs and requirements. They must be bringing their laptops to the first day of class. If you're looking for the requirements for the laptop, you can see in the link above on our workforce development, network technical support, you want to select the better model. It will need to be a Windows PC. Minimum requirements are Windows 10, the 7th Gen iCourse i5, uh, minimum of 8 gigs of RAM, must have webcam functionality, audio capability, speakers, and a high quality headset, as well as a, a integrated graphics card with 256 gig if SSD or higher is recommended. So comments, common questions. What types of jobs can we look forward to? Graduates will have the skills necessary to find employment as a tier one or tier two, two, two help support, as well as network technician and desktop support. For more details related to occupations, job markets, you can see on the Government of Canada website. You can also look on Indeed for job searches. There's some keywords to look for when you're looking on Indeed, Windows Server, Networking, Linux, and VMware. Thank you for taking the time today to listen to the virtual orientation. For more information, please reach out to Carol Schliebert at cschliebert at conestogac.on.ca. I hope you enjoy your time here at Conestoga College, and I look forward to seeing you in class.